Okay. Compare the following ratios and find out which one is greater. So you are given basically three ratios. 3 is to 7, 5 is to 9, and 6 is to 11. Right? Now each one of these can be written as a fraction also. So you can write 3 is to 7 as 3 upon 7, 5 is to 9 as 5 upon 9, and 6 is to 11 as 6 upon 11. Right? Now, if you remember or if you recall, we did something in terms of comparing the fractions, right? Similarly, we can apply the same logic over here also. So what do we do? We do convert the denominator or the consequent as it is called in ratios into a common number. So we take the least common multiple of these three numbers, 7, 9, and 11. Now incidentally, all of them are prime numbers. So basically the LCM will be 7 into 9 into 11. Right? You can also try this on your own, but this is the answer that you will get. Okay, let me do it for you. 7, 9, 11. So we try 7, we are left with 9 and 11. We try 9, we are left with 11. We do it by 11, we get 1. So the LCM comes to 7 into 9 into 11. So if you see, this will come basically 9 into 11 is 99. 99 into 7 is 693. Okay? So you make the denominator as 693 for each of these three. Right? Once you have done this, then you need to see what have you done? What have you multiplied the denominator or the consequent with. So if it is 7, then basically you have multiplied it with what? 9 and 11. So you need to multiply the numerator or this 3 into 11 into 9. Similarly for 5, 9 is already here, so you have multiplied it by 7 and 11. Similarly for this one, 6 into 11 is already here, so 7 into 9. Right? So 11 into 9 gives you 99. 99 into 3 gives you 297. 5 into 7 is 35. 35 into 11 is 350 plus 35, 385. 6 into 7 is 42, 42 into 9 is 420 minus 42 or 378. Now when the denominators are same, the number with the numerator is the bigger fraction. Accordingly, 385 which is having the greatest numerator is the greatest one. Right? So ratio of 5 is to 9 is greater amongst these three given ratios.